on this visit, other than the opportunity to try freshly filleted sashimi and a range of salmon dishes prepared by the in-house chef, I would also get a go at feeding and catching a salmon. One of the locals suggested that I should try to catch a salmon at one of the local businesses, High Country Salmon. And so I've got one of their t-shirts and a cap and I'm going to give it a go and see if I've got any luck to catch a salmon. High Country Salmon, located at Twizel, has been trading for over 20 years and has a license to farm the equivalent to 185,000 salmon fishes. Hi guys, I'm over at High Country Salmon. I've got Sammy next to me and he's probably got the coolest job title in the world and his title is Catch a Fish Manager. <laughs> so Sammy is from England but he's been in New Zealand for over a decade and he loves this place. What it's going to do is that it's going to hand me this rod and then hopefully keep my fingers crossed that I'll be successful in catching a salmon. Good luck, mate. Cheers, thank you. So how do I do this, Sammy? Okay, right. Put it down here. Yeah, leave that. Don't touch it. Put your, put your rod tip right down with the water. And yes, I think I've got a salmon. Ooh, this is so exciting. Gee, it's a lot harder work than it's a lot harder work than having sashimi. <laughs> it's been about a minute, or maybe just over a minute. I think I'm winning the battle. Such a cool experience. If you have got kids, this is something that they must try. Hey, well done, man. Hey guys, this is a 2.6 kilogram salmon and I caught this literally in, um, what, 90 seconds? Maybe I'm exaggerating, maybe a bit more time. But if it wasn't for Sammy who's next to me, who's been so helpful, but this is such a cool experience. Not only do you get a chance to learn about salmon and how they breed, uh, but of course, you know, you get a chance to taste the very, very fresh sashimi in the cafe right here at High Country Salmon. We are so fortunate to land a salmon and the chef here at High Country Salmon has very kindly sashimi this salmon filet and here it is right here on my plate. It can't get any fresher than this. What I'm going to do now guys is I'm just going to mix a bit of wasabi in the soy sauce. Grab a nice chunky piece of salmon, dip it into it. It is firm, not the least oily that I would normally taste with other salmon. Absolutely delicious. Maybe one more slice to go. Many of you guys will know that I'm a big pie fan and I've got here a pie that you can only find here, right here at the High Country Salmon and it's built by the famous Bailey Bake House which is located here in the Mackenzie District. That's it, this is a special pie because you can only find this right here at High Country Salmon. And it is salmon, lemon and kumara which is sweet potato. And I have to say, it's, um, I just got two thumbs up from Tracy and from uh, Jason right behind me because I keep messing up the ingredients. But just to be clear, it is salmon, lemon and kurma. Ooh, it is crispy. Check out the filling. Gorgeous. And for the final dish, I have the baked salmon wings. This is oven baked with taraki sauce. And even sitting outside, I can actually smell the aroma of the baked salmon wings coming through, absolutely delicious. <laughs>